Hello, welcome to the U of How To. So today, I just want to go through a really quick video here just to show you how you can open up rich text formats, so RTF files, in your Google Drive, okay, using Google Docs. So I'm in my D2L, my Brightspace uh, summer school course here, and I have some students having trouble opening up the files that are loaded in my content. So let's look at this one first. Fill this, fill this worksheet in as you work through. So they need to be able to open up this worksheet. So as soon as you click on this, it downloads this RTF, this rich text format file. Okay, and uh, one way to open this up is in Microsoft Word. That would work well uh, and uh, make it editable and you know, save it as a Word document and, and do what you need to with that. Okay, we can also do this with Google Docs. Uh, if I just try opening it now, it's going to try opening it as a Word uh, on WordPad, excuse me, and uh, it just comes out like gibberish, right? Symbols, so that's not going to help. So now that I've downloaded that, I can go to my Google Drive and the folder. I have my summer school folder, so I'm going to upload it to this folder. So this is the one here that I just downloaded. Okay, there it is. So now I can open it if I want to just view it. Okay, kind of like a PDF. I can open it and see it uh, in my Google Drive. Okay, but that doesn't really help, right, if I want to edit especially. So I can either from here, from this page I can open with Google Docs or from the Google Drive I can right click and open with Google Docs. Okay and so Google Docs will kind of convert it into a Google Doc and now this is a Google Doc file it's completely editable Okay and once I'm done with it I can close you can see in my drive there is a new file this one is the Google Doc this one is the rich text format so I don't need this rich text format file anymore uh, so let's remove it okay and so that's all that's all you need to do to be able to open up a RTF file is just use Google Drive and Google Docs okay so hopefully that helps and if you have any questions comments concerns please let me know Leave a comment in the comments down below and I will see you in the next one.